That's just from the estrogen. <laughs> I saw a thing today that said, if you bought a truck and your truck did not have balls on it and you put balls on it, congratulations, you now have, you now have a trans truck. <laughs> Only the ones that don't have the gun rack in the back window. <laughs> I'm going to have to remember that. I'm a great believer of when in Rome. <laughs> you know <what> I'm saying? <laughs> Keep the peace, my friend. Not me. I like fucking with people. <laughs> wow. Uh, and that's when you get the cup I of... Uh, they do. There was, uh... you get, a, get a cup of glitter and water, and you walk <laughs> over, and you dip them in the glitter water. <laughs> there was a guy that he was uh, a big Charley farmer, plus he owned a bunch of car lots around here. Anyway, on his, at his house, he had this big Charley bull up on this fucking pedestal that was pretty tall, but it had some big old balls, and people would always get up there and paint them different color, you know, the oh, Charleys are white, but <laughs> people would climb up there and paint the balls bright green or red or whatever, you know. Sorry, whoever I hit there. I was telling the ball story and got excited. <laughs> got excited. Yeah, we got a sign yeah, like that around here. Yeah. Nah. Uh, sounds like he wants to hear a camping story with Michael Walter. Well, this old guy, he was a, my buddy that I used to go to the car show <coughs> with a lot. He was good ah. friends with this guy because they raised Charlotte cattle oh, also. Oh, no. And this old guy was rich as fuck. <laughs> and he'd come out there in a big Cadillac out, drive out in the cow field. He'd drive out in the cow field. He looked like Moss Hog in a big Cadillac, chewing on a big cigar. He'd come rolling out on the farm and that shit, looking at the cows, you know. Yeah, no, he he wasn't going to do nothing. No, he'd just roll out there and look at them and say, how you boys doing? These guys be on horses and shit rounding up the cattle but he was just rolled out there in his Cadillac anyway when I was a teenager I went to work for him at his dealership I worked in the parts department he's a big bragger motherfucker anyway he rolls up and his parts department was shit I mean it was m messed up you couldn't find nothing there wasn't nothing in numerical like order you needed a little nudge to get up there silver so I'm up there and I'm, a, I'm in high school and I'm up there straightening this shit up where it's kind of normal he walks up there and said hey boy you know what you're doing up here i said hell yeah i'm making this fucking mess look like something <laughs> give him shit because he's giving me shit like he's gonna talk them to me you know and i thought fuck you gonna give me shit when i'm making this shit look like something but he was just that kind of guy be chewing on his big cigar and Big bragger, <laughs> motherfucker. But he had plenty of money. He did have a lot of money. So he owned, he owned the car dealerships, and he had a huge ass farm, and he raised in Charlotte cattle and shit. He had a lot of money. Cattleman. Yeah. Did y'all see the new uh, Challenger Daytona just released today? What's that now? Tell us again. I didn't hear you. Dodge Challenger Daytona just released today. Uh-uh. 
electric. <laughs> Can't Piece be electric. Of Piece of shit. Ooh, yeah, I don't oh. even like the ones that people buy that are the cheaper version. You know, they pull up next to you and you don't hear anything. <laughs> they don't have the Hemi in it. Yeah, or the four door. Or a six like, cylinder. Yeah, they stop the gas and say, This like, is the worst fucking shit. I swear to God, I came into the negative Nancy convention. Oh, uh, yeah, we just talking out. about the electric fucking tractors and shit, and we're all down on them. Them fuckers <laughs> trying to take over the world by bringing all this bullshit in ain't never gonna work. Whatever. We'll see. Never gonna work. Yeah, just buy another ten million dollars worth of tractors and. Well, they're nah, trying to make us all suffer happening. while they figure it out. It we'll find, it. We'll find we're another place. We suffer while they figure it out. We're making they need ourselves to figure it suffer. Out. We su we're suffering because we didn't listen 25 years ago when they warned us the first fucking time. Who, who warned us? I never heard nobody right. say that. Is that when I never they heard said nobody it, say it, that it, shit. Of course you did. You did. Is that when they said the world was going to end in 25 years? Uh, Don't the temperature worry. temperature is 10 degrees it actually, hotter, gas it was three times as yeah. much. We're running out of water, air, I'm, food. I'm sure... I'm sure we'll find another planet to rape they, someplace in the near future. Don't worry about it. <laughs> they did. They did warn us in that movie, Back to the Future. That's right. The greedy yeah, government. That's when it's they not the greedy us. people. It's not the 300 million greedy people. <clears throat> people, human race is a virus. <laughs> we I are agree. a virus on the planet. <laughs> I agree. I agree. After all the humans die, the Earth will heal. Heck, yeah. fuck yeah. <laughs> Kick us off like a bad cold. Right. Wow. Yep. <laughs> Earth's gonna have a Earth's gonna have a barbecue. <laughs> it's it's it. I gotta go. What? You guys are too fucking argumentative <laughs> and fucking stupid. Well, I can't stand it. You guys are doom dooming your own fucking you children. Watch it fucking makes that's me how sick. The universe works. Ill. Well, it makes us sick to hear you slide off the bullshit out of So thank you. Opinions <laughs> <laughs> yeah. are like assholes. Everybody's got one and they're all full of shit. What? You gotta watch the, how the universe works. That tells you how, how what all the shit that can kill us. <laughs> I got all the answers. That's, That's what sucks. they teach them in prison. No. It ain't feasible right now. It's not feasible. <laughs> yeah, four years. I got a, I got a plan. I'm do it in the No. I, I got a great electric plan. Here's a fork. Go over there. China, Russia, and all them other countries ain't doing nothing. Halfway on your journey to get the other. <laughs> so you gotta buy you're gonna find out. Your five million dollar dollar combine, six of them, so you can go. They're gonna use them. They're gonna use them just like they're using them. They're gonna use them. Uh, hit pause. Pause. Oh, nice catch. I I don't hey. I, I keep hearing about all these military vehicles, and I keep seeing them on the interstates, and they ain't a fucking one of them electric. Imagine that. It'll... 
You guys got to remember that um, Harvick's an electrician, so he likes electric shit. <laughs> Harvick's a fucking. But they like well, that's a, they like traffic jams. They they the generate time. power when you step on the brake. <laughs> what else do you want to know? The, the electric shit is just. Uh, Adam. What happened? Then, then 20 years again? from now, you'll hear electricity causes cancer. Yeah. 